Hello everyone! Welcome to Monday Measures week number 21! <laughs> this is a different angle for me. <laughs> and I'm trying to get my hair dry enough I could do something with it here. I haven't done anything with it yet. Well, so I'll look different in a few minutes. <laughs> but today I'm going to make this chicken cheese and biscuits. This actually came out of a Weight Watchers book. It calls for, um, oh, the refrigerator, the Pillsbury biscuits or something, but I'm going to make it with, uh, you know, the, like, biscuit biscuits type thing. Got tea going here. I'm still drinking the tea. But I got my chicken. I'm cooking up all my chicken because it calls for cubed cooked chicken. And I cube my chicken before I cook it. Because I'm usually <laughs> using it hot when I when I put it in the recipe. I don't make it the day before or anything. And it cooks quicker that way. So this was all still kind of frozen when I cut it up. Actually, I think it's easier to cut it up that way too, because I use scissors to cut it. The kitchen scissors. Well, <laughs> actually, they're not kitchen scissors, but I'm still gonna find some place to sharpen my kitchen scissors or somebody to sharpen them for me. So I'm going to let that brown and go do something with my hair and I'll be back. Hair's kind of under control. <laughs> and Mary's here. Yeah. I got her breaking up little frozen green beans. This is, this is kind of like a chicken pot pie in a in a casserole. Oh, so, sounds good. Yeah. Yeah, so and we're gonna make like a a roux, <laughs> and uh, and then we're gonna put the chicken in it, and then we're gonna put it in the casserole and cook it. Green beans are frozen. My fingers are cold. <laughs> yeah, and I was working with the frozen chicken earlier, so my hands were getting kind of you know really frozen. So I'm gonna while she's doing that, I'm gonna cut up some carrots and. And then we got mushrooms we're going to get out here too. And we'll show you everything that goes in there. So we got everything that we need out here. So green beans, carrots, mushrooms, got our chicken. We got our flour and milk for the, for the sauce. And, <laughs> and then all the seasonings and cheese. We got a dog making sure the ingredients are yeah. <laughs> good. He just wants to eat everything. <laughs> and then I got my, my pot waiting there to make the sauce. And I got this. And I got green beans back there. We, we're going to have our Sunday meal, but my oldest daughter is not going to be able to make it. And, yeah. and her husband, they've been running around all morning. And they're still having water issues at their house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're... Their pump ended up, it was leaking, so there was mold. Oh. So, yeah. So, they got that fixed. And then I got this pan out for our, our dinner dinner. Ugh, I'll move that. But we're waiting. Oh, don't mind the dish, dish water there. <laughs> but we're waiting for um, hard-boiled eggs. I'm going to make some deviled eggs. Yeah. Oh, and there it goes. It's ringing. Oh. <laughs> Where'd you go? <laughs> Over there. <laughs> I don't know what's happening, but Mom is putting butter in, in the, pot. the pot. Get the extra 
in there. Whoa. Where are you going? <laughs> I'm gonna run you over. <laughs> in the stove on high. And yeah. Let the butter melt. Oh look, you can see the reflection of the butter in the pan. Oh, that's cool. Makes like it look a, really big. Like a picture. It yeah. makes it look like, from here, it makes it look like a whole stick of butter. Right? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's interesting. Because of the, the, the bowed angle. shape. Gotta get that really hot. Butter is very melty. Five tablespoons of flour. Make sure that incorporates really good. Get like this real creamy consistency. Teaspoon of dry mustard. Mm. A half a teaspoon of sage. A little bit of Italian blend. Ooh. I think that's all we need right now. Ooh, that smells good. Yeah, make sure it doesn't burn. Yeah. This is cooking really fast. I like to get it to a point to where it looks like it's getting kind of brown. And inner milk goes. Uh, steam everywhere. And you gotta really watch that. It's gotta be stirred constantly. All that stuff has to come off the bottom. Oh, good to know. <laughs> and she turned the stove down on low. Yeah, because this stove stays hot. Oops. It's making me so hungry. <laughs> What are we doing? <laughs> it's getting thick. It smells really good. Yeah. See how fast that's bubbling when I stop? Yeah. Yeah, you gotta really, because you don't want that to scorch on the bottom of the pan. Chicken broth in there. Chicken broth? Or chicken. Chicken, <laughs> chicken or whatever you call it, the powder stuff. Okay. <laughs> Powdered what chicken do you, what broth. What do you call that? Yeah, the, the flavored bouillon, yeah. And some pepper. What do you call it? Essence of chicken, like you're making a potion. Yeah. Just essence put, of chicken. Put some <laughs> essence of chicken in there. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, yeah, it's uh, really hot looking. Yeah. See what I mean? Gotta stir, put, stir, stir. Uh, cheese in there. Oh, I love cheese. A cup of cheese. Actually, it's about a cup and a half. Well, I like cheese, so <laughs> lots of cheese for me. <laughs> That's all good and melted. Oh, 
Looks like it's getting darker. Yeah, look how thick that is. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I just want to eat that now. <laughs> it looks like a really good, like, thick sauce. Yeah. I'm gonna put our vegetables in there. Oh, elbow. Just about two cups of each kind of vegetable. Easy. A little bit of extra mushrooms because we have a little bit less beans. Yeah, we have some green beans, some carrots, and some mushrooms. Yeah, one of the carrots got stuck in the hole of the cutting board. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> it's like a volcano. Well, I'll cool it off a little bit. This just seems to me right now like a really thick, good, like, sauce for, like, some sort of a vegetable, um, pasta or something. <laughs> but it's gonna be a casserole. Right. Put a little bit of this juice in here. As, as most all of it goes in. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe it won't, probably won't be bad because it looks really thick. Chicken. Bean is like, uh, it smells good over here. She's under your feet back there somewhere. <laughs> sniff, 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 sniff. And we're going to cook that for about five minutes. Yeah. Just get the vegetables a little bit tender before we put it in the pot. Amy wants the chicken. He wants the snacks. I know it smells amazing. Dogs are like, where is that glorious smell coming from? They keep staring at me like, um, where is it? Where's the food? <laughs> Put, putting a little extra <laughs> chicken bouillon in there. Cause she, her nose is special. She was like sniffing it and she's like, I think I should put some more in. <laughs> yeah. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> well, I doubled the recipe. Because got lots of big eaters here and we're making for the week, right? Yeah. And then this will be good leftovers for um, Heather for work and yep. lunches yeah. or even if she's just home. Yeah, she takes lunch every day with her. She doesn't buy lunch. They don't have lunch available there. Yeah. So she packs it. Keepy, 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 keepy. What? What? He's one, he bit you. He's gonna, he's gonna lick the mitt. Does it have, like, chicken juice on it or something? Like, why, why are you sniffing that? Your mom was saying that apparently you only cook the casserole in the oven for like seven to ten minutes. Yeah. So you gotta make sure that your, your carrots are cooked in this thing. Are you hungry yet? Because I am. <laughs> I'm starving. I this know. Looks, looks, it smells really good. Just want to like grab a little piece. Just, ah! <laughs> Back my fingers out of the way. Oh, I got some sauce though. I could lick it. <laughs> Burn your fingers. It tastes good. Okay. Put it in the pan. Huh. Steamy. I wish your arm was in my way. <laughs> it looks glorious.
sauce is on one side and then uh, spread it out. It nice and even. <gasps> I forgot to take the cookie sheet out of the stove there. Ooh, we're gonna just like set it on top. <laughs> I forgot I put one in there. It wasn't quite dry, so I put it in there. Now it's dry. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. And this is just a bisquick. You know, it calls for the, um, the Pillsbury dough biscuits. Oh. So, but we always use the Bisquick stuff here. This is actually, um, oh, the Krusties, their biscuit mix. Yeah. I love casseroles with biscuits in it. I don't know, there's just something about biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> right. I just like biscuits. <laughs> and there she is. She smells food and she starts crunch, crunch, crunch. Oh, yeah. So I always got the crunch, crunch, crunch in the background. There, there's the culprit. She Hello. smells the food. She's like, oh, you're taking a video of me. Hello there. <laughs> <laughs> she came up and looked right at me. Just kind of spread them out evenly across the top of there. <laughs> Got all the biscuits on me. Boy, we need to clean the oven. We spilled stuff in there this week. Yeah, it's now a little burnt. <laughs> it's pretty ironic. I was in the middle of dinner and uh, third local, well, kind of local butcher called. <laughs> and I had ordered a half of a half a cow and a side of beef in the summer last year. And I was supposed to get it in October. And she never called. <laughs> and I just, I really couldn't afford it anyway. So I was going to split it with somebody else, my, my oldest daughter. And uh, I had room in the freezer, you know, because I cleaned the freezer out and and all of that, and she never called. Well, now she called, and now I don't have room in the freezer. My freezer is jam, jam packed. Because oh, so it's a Yeah, because <laughs> we made we made that list, and then we filled it up. You know, last time I cleaned it. A little so. lucky, you know. She's good. Like <laughs> yeah. She's like, oh, you called me out because I was chewing food on your video again. <laughs> I'm also so. having to like stand on my tippy toes over here, man. <laughs> like, get in here. Like, I look taller. <laughs> <laughs> She's so short. Yeah. <laughs> She's 5'4, I'm 5'8. I never thought so I was. So there's short. really not that much difference. It looks like I got a good six inches. Maybe I am still 5'10, but I got shoes on too. I oh, have you do too. Oh, yeah, kinda. They're pretty flat. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Mary's Mary's seeing a difference in her pants. Yeah, uh, you know, like the button part. There's always like sometimes 
the uh, the button part, if your pants are starting to get tight, the like it kind of pokes out a little bit and creates like a little bump, and you're like, eh, like trying to flatten it all the time. <laughs> well, I don't have to worry about that now. It's just always flat. Yeah. Like it feels like uh, all the steps and stuff she's doing on the Wii are working. It does feel like it hasn't changed that much around like like under like the lower hip area because that part's getting toned mm -hmm. and kind of shaped out. But like in my like in my like waist above there, it mm -hmm. definitely feels like looser ish. Yeah. And I think my legs are yeah. starting to look more toned. <laughs> and since the sun has been out, I've I've got my pedometer back on me again. I've got it in my pocket all the time, and I'm getting close to ten thousand steps every day. So, you know, like I said, when we hit spring, we go and. And I don't really have to worry about, you know, exercise because we're going all the time. But I do need to exercise because I still not breathing right. And, yeah, just work on some. Yeah, some and I want to be areas. able to go hiking this summer <laughs> oh, yeah. without like dying going up a hill. <laughs> <laughs> I like hiking. Yeah. All right, so this is it's got about six more minutes to go. I put sit. I set it for ten minutes because I. I put the whole, like what you would do, a whole drop biscuit, and the recipe called for cutting those, um, your refrigerator biscuits up, and then putting them on there. Um, all right, <laughs> we'll wait for that, and I don't know, you think we can come up with a dessert, Mary? Uh, um, <laughs> we could try. <laughs> if there's no dessert on here, we failed. So. <laughs> we don't want to fail. Oh, okay. Maybe, well, we'll figure like, it out. Maybe make a smoothie or something. Ooh. <laughs> I am Mary kind of like smoothies. hungry right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we'll show you what it's like, what it looks like when it's done. <laughs> there you go. All done. It actually took about 20 minutes. I guess I could have made the biscuit smaller. <laughs> Huh. But yeah, we were watching them, waiting for them to brown on top. Yeah, that's when you know they're done. Yeah, it looks yummy. So we found this microwave recipe but I'm gonna fry it on top of the stove because this looks like it would make an awesome fried banana recipe. So we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this bananas. Um, Brazilian bananas? For, yeah, the Brazilian bananas. Fry them on the stove. So my stove is kind of a mess because <laughs> we haven't cleaned the stove yet from dinner. But we're gonna make this banana thing and I got butter in the pan ready to go. Got the brown sugar stuffs and some allspice and cinnamon and Mary's making noise doing all the dinner dishes. I always got it. I'm always the one who has to do dishes. <laughs> I did them today. Well, after dinner. And then okay. we got the bananas and we're going to soak the bananas in lemon juice and we'll get all that going. So soaking my bananas and lemon juice. I cut them all in half and then slice those halves in half. Oh. So we got banana quarters. Did you put that? You put lemon juice in there? Yeah, I put lemon juice oh. in there. I'm gonna put a lid on it and I'm gonna flip it over so that way I make sure they soak really good. So I'm gonna take my brown sugar and I've got an eighth, eighth of a teaspoon here. And put an eighth of a teaspoon of allspice. And an eighth of a teaspoon of cinnamon. Yeah. 
mix that up really good. And then we're going to pour that over top of the bananas. And let that sit for a minute while this is, the butter is getting warm. Okay, I got my bananas. Oops, is that clean? <laughs> yes. Man. <laughs> I'm throwing dirty dishes in Mary's clean dishes. So here's a tricky part. I don't know how this is going to go. This has got to be poured over top of the bananas. But we don't want to break the bananas. And I want to get it all over each one of them. See, look, there's one that didn't get it yet. Excuse you. Oh, and now I broke one. I guess I could have put it in a plate or something. It says pour it over. But I guess I could have put it in a plate and, you know, like rolled them in there. I guess that looks pretty good. Oh, that one doesn't look like it got much on it. <laughs> and I broke one. Oops. Okay. Butter's getting hot. It's all bubbly. microwave recipe originally you need like enough butter to fry them all right i mean you'd need that much to fry them on the stove too right? <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay we're gonna put these in there because that gets really hot <laughs> So there it is. We're frying it up. And then once it's fried up and it's almost done, we're gonna sprinkle it with coconut. So this is taking longer than I thought. This is gonna get all caramely because that's what butter and brown sugar does is get caramely. <laughs> it smells glorious. It does. I guess you have to wait for it to get thick. Patience, patience, patience. Okay. Yeah, it didn't say anything about turning it over, and they're getting kind of mushy. So, I guess we'll throw the coconut on there now. And it calls for two-thirds of a cup. That's quite a bit of coconut. Good thing we like coconut. Okay. 
It looks almost like French toast. It says to cook one or two more minutes until the bananas are soft. Hey, they're already soft. Okay, mom is going to plate these up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. You know, the bananas are soft. We were just thinking these would go really good over top of ice cream, you know? Mm-hmm. Because that looks really sweet. It smells so good. Yeah, it smells really sweet. But the bananas are soft, so I don't know how you do that without... I don't know, slide them out of there? I guess so. That didn't work so good. <laughs> it's a learning process. Yeah, look at all the juice. That would actually go really good over top of ice cream or something. Right, I just want it in my belly. What if you just like gave this to someone and you were like, okay, here is our like specialty, like giant um, caterpillar. <laughs> Like cooked, cooked, glazed <laughs> caterpillars. <laughs> they would be like, what? <laughs> okay. I guess that's it. I'm not going to put all that juice on there because it looks like a lot of sweet. Ooh. Dessert is served. I'm putting this really hot pan in this thing, Why, Mom? Why? <laughs> <laughs> it's really hot. Did you burn your tongue? No, no. I blew off that oh, piece. Oh, okay. I didn't just go off. <laughs> <laughs> mm. So you can use your alternative sugar. And if you want to make it dairy free, you can use your um, ghee or, or alternative butter. This is good though. I think yeah. it would be really good with that stuff. The alternative stuff price tastes pretty close to the real mm -hmm. stuff to me. I like it. Yeah. I like all the coconut. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Life thought we were gonna make bananas foster. He was waiting for us to set something on fire. <laughs> That's kind of what it looks like, you know? It does. Well, it actually doesn't taste much different. Mm -hmm. Like you could totally put this on top of like a piece of uh, cake or something. Mm. This, this is actually good the way it is. Mm -hmm. I probably would have been disappointed if I put it on top of ice cream. Mm. Kip is trying to steal a little piece. He's looking in the air over here. <laughs> well, I'll be over here eating this. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's it. That's all we got for you this Monday for the Monday measures. And we'll see you on Wednesday mm -hmm. for the vlog on Wednesday. Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching. <laughs>